the, there is this line of Dolce Vita that we need to, <laughs> to maybe change the, the point on the line. I can say one more thing <laughs> about you. <laughs> I'm Karolina, I'm 27 years old, I'm uh, from Kraków and uh, I am with uh, my Italian boyfriend uh, for, for seven years. I'm Emanuele, I'm uh, Italian, I'm from Naples, uh, south of Italy and I'm 28 years old. I'm uh, living now in uh, Poland and I'm from um, seven years in a relation with a Polish girl, uh, Karolina, and uh, I am at the moment uh, living in, uh, in Poland, in Warsaw. So when I first told my family that I was dating uh, a Paul, um, the reaction was not what I expected uh, and uh, I was feeling really in love with Carolina and um, still now, but I remember the reaction from my family and they told like, wow, from Poland, why so far away? But what are you going to do? You are stupid. They re literally told me that I'm a stupid guy or that I'm uh, crazy, that I think that I can have a relation with uh, women from another country in distance, because at the beginning was in distance. Um, and also my friends, even younger friends, told me like, okay, it's an adventure or, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's not gonna work and, you know. Uh. My friends and my family didn't really know a lot about Italians. Uh, I remember when Manu came first time, uh, we were like, we knew each other already a few months and Manu came to, um, to our um, home, to, to the house and the, everybody was, were pretty feeling like he's exotic, he's some uh, kind of, uh, not monument, but they were like, hey Manu, let's take a picture together <laughs> because, uh, because they felt that he's uh, from abroad, he's foreigners, he um, he's someone new because we never um, had a guest like him in the in the house. So they felt he's um, I don't know how to say something someone unique, someone uh, special in, in in the house. More than one time, someone uh, thought that Carolina was in Italy because she was going to work with some older guy helping him like many people did in the past years. So this I didn't like and also I don't like that people sometimes define Pauls as working with older people because it's not like this. And also that uh, Poland is um, like a developing country that is completely like, uh, like if you have never been to Poland, you are going to be surprised. So sometimes, you know, um, people doesn't know and they think that it's still like maybe 50 years ago so it's not anymore like this and also maybe about the alcohol and uh, that the Polish people is drinking that maybe they have some issue on drinking that is about vodka and, uh, and um, I'm also scared the moment in which like my older family will face older family of her and it will be like okay let's take a shot and I don't know how it's going to be actually but yeah, maybe I will put water in the, in the bottle, so, for my family. Italians sometimes are too relaxed, uh, especially about the, the time. Like, if we meet at uh, 6, please be at 6. Because, I don't know, maybe we have appointment in the restaurants, maybe we have the movie in the cinema, or maybe we have the bus that we need to take the, that. And we had a lot of uh, argues because Manu was late for the, uh, for the appointment and we lost the bus while I used to live with my parents. The most, the most, the most is the pasta inside the soup. Like, that is too overcooked. So when I go, for example, to somewhere, like to the mountains, I always say, like, I love, for example, uh, Zupa Gchibova but best macaroni because they are cooked you know for hours hours so you know for me it's like you know i also say to her mother like like i like everything but just the super please rosso without the the pasta the pasta yeah and uh, yeah about the <coughs> differences in uh, enjoying the moment at the table with the family for the rest i think that i don't have many uh, complaints about Polish people. Maybe, yes, they are less open. I feel that there is uh, like kind of a border between the people. Uh, but uh, yeah, I think uh, there are no many complaints. And I think that in general, Polish people likes Italy. So I feel sometimes uh, lucky that, you know, when I say that I'm Italian, sometimes uh, there is a good reaction, like, uh, so. 
but yeah. at the end uh, I have I think I have the same feelings I never was feeling bad in Italy like maybe um, I had one situation that um, I remember but it was not even racism from Italian to that I'm Polish I remember when we came to to house of some part of the family of Manu and uh, they wanted to be nice but it's it was kind of rude, I have to say. They told me like, ah, long time ago, we had a lady who was helping us, Polish lady who was helping us in the, um, in the house. And they started to speak about her in a not really nice way. So was like f making me feel maybe that I was... Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Also made me feel bad now because Actually, yeah, maybe 30, 40 years ago, there was many, many Polish women coming to Italy to helping uh, older people. Mm -hmm. Why now is, is the opposite? I would like sometimes that he will, he could take things more serious, like not be so chill. Like that we need chill in our life. We need to take things easier. But sometimes uh, when I ask him for something and I really want him to do it, I cannot wait a few days, you know, <laughs> or we need to take the decision. He's more like, okay, we have time, we, we can plan it. So I think that there is this border uh, or th there is this line of Dolce Vita that we need <laughs> to maybe change the, the point on the line. I can say one more thing <laughs> about you. <laughs> Manu said um, uh, a lot that I hate cooking because it's literally that I'm hate uh, that I hate uh, cooking, but I love the thing that he loves to cook. <laughs> like he loves to to prepare the things, and he always does the the, the best. And uh, it's not that every Italian is cooking and knows how to cook pasta, because also he has friends uh, who really don't know that, but uh, he, I like uh, the thing that he, uh, he knows from where he is. He knows um, also the um, ad uh, like pluses and minuses of, of Italy, and he, he knows how to take the, the best from them. So. Uh, I really like how he cooks and the way he, he, he does it. For me, I have to say that um, <clears throat> maybe it's not completely related to, to being Polish, but I like that she uh, completely opened me to me another world, uh, all Poland and the whole her family. So I like the thing that I can say that I have also a family in Poland and that I'm part of it. So. I feel like kind of, uh, you know, for, uh, for a small percentage Polish and uh, I love that, you know, she made me completely feel at home and uh, uh, she, she uh, and also her family did it, so I really Even if I really don't know how it. to cook. <laughs> Even, but your mother does, so, you know, <laughs> there, is, there is always kachka for, uh, for Christmas, so. Yeah.